Hey YouTube, Jason here with Day Train Fearless. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. And if you have any questions, anything like that, leave them down below in the uh, comments. And as always, let's jump right into it. So today's another uh, think or swip and script code um, that uh, you guys might find uh, interesting. It's uh, for market profile. Um, so right here I have a one minute chart. And it's showing me a market profile, but if you could see, it's only for this time frame, right? So if you think about what this market profile right here is for, it's only up to this point, which is essentially about one hour of time. So if I want to see market profile kind of really broken down and only go, hey, what's it look like for the last one hour on the one minute chart? I could show it, right? So it shows me. As you could see, um, as we start to break out, you could see maybe where potential support or resistance is. If you think about it, during this time, this was um, a somewhat high volume node, not the highest. The point of control was here. But on this, as we kind of broke out, we pulled back, we came right back down to this high volume node and so on, right? So, um, if you want to change anything, go into edit, edit studies. Um, it's called cool multi time frame market profile, right? Come here and then you can adjust where you want to see it, right? Different times. So let's say I want to show this is going to be the most important one, the minute. Let's say I only want to show for the last half hour. Okay. On the one minute. Click OK, apply. Now it only shows me time for the last half hour of time, right? If I only want to see every 15 minutes of time, I'll come down here and I'll change that to 15 minutes and it'll show me every 15 minutes, right? So you could see it breaks it down for each and every single one. If I want to maybe change it for a different time frame, OK? Well, you could see it just shows us here, but let's say we go here, change, right? And let's say, let's see for every one hour, okay, 60 minutes, but this time, let's, yeah, let's uh, keep it nine, click apply, and then it breaks it down for every one hour or every four bars, you'll see a different market profile. So if we came back down, maybe I would look at this as a support level, okay, to buy if I want to look longer term or something like that. But again, if we just go back to um, a shorter time frame, if you want to see more time, all this, go into edit, edit studies, click on the little wheel, right, and under profiles we'll do 50 profiles click ok apply and now it adds all these different profiles for each and every one so again if you just want to see maybe all those profiles but let's go hey let's look at every three hours so 6 12 18 well we'll say every four hours that's uh, 240 minutes right apply it'll show us kind of break it down into just that amount of time so it really really helps you i believe if you're looking for um whatever time frame days weeks uh if you want but you'll need to change the profiles how many you could see also the time and different things like that if i want to go hey let's go five day five minute right every 240 minutes of uh time it'll show us um, or if we want, just come back here and change this to, hey, let's see every hour worth of time and let's change this to only the last 10 profiles um, to kind of keep the, the chart semi-clean so it cleans it all up and it just shows us what the last uh, few, uh, 
10 pro 10 hours we'll say for since each one is one hour so i hope you guys like this i'll leave a link below uh down in the uh studies and uh, you could download it with the uh chart and as always i hope this has uh, been really really helpful for you guys of um and maybe uh, helpful towards your uh trading so as always thank you for watching the link will be down below and Good luck trading, and until next time, we'll talk to you soon. Thank you.